<clears throat> well, uh, hello everybody. Thank you for coming to this session. Um, uh, we will talk about uh, particle filtering with Dynar and uh, more precisely uh, about uh, nonlinear estimation of DSG model. I'm Frédéric Caramé from uh, University uh, of Le Mans, and this is a joint uh, work with uh, Stéphane Adjemian. So the motivation of this session is uh, when you need to estimate uh, non-linearly solved uh, DSG models. So in fact, you need to capture um, economic features that are more complicated than the one you can capture in a, a linear approximation with perturbation. And uh, the basic idea is that uh, when you need uh, uh, models solved with higher order than one, uh, the, the solved uh, form of the model is no more tractable anymore with the Kalman filter. So you need more sophisticated methods to estimate uh, properly this is model. And uh, uh, the point is uh, the approximation uh, can make you lose uh, some information about the deep parameters of the models. So uh, maybe sometimes you need to uh, solve the, in a more complicated form uh, your model. So to just make an insight about notation that uh, probably you have encountered with Michel or uh, Johannes, the basic idea here is that when you solve the model uh, linearly, you, uh, you obtain a first order approximation with Z, uh, the variables containing both uh, observed and unobserved variables. But it is a linear form. So uh, this can be uh, uh, estimated using the Kalman filter and the maximum likelihood. When you do order two, for instance, here you have the expression that uh, we, we obtain. You can see that we have the same linear form at the beginning, but you have also uh, squared terms and uh, cross product terms. Uh, so that uh, render the, this expression uh, nonlinear. And uh, so on if you increase uh, the order of uh, the resolution. So here, uh, one can see that uh, uh, it is no more a linear uh, representation and that Kalman filter is uh, useless. So the outline of the talk and uh, we, we will divide each section by uh, an audio file with uh, a comment. So the, the, the first part of the talk will be, de will be devoted to Bayesian filtering methods. So uh, I will introduce the notations and uh, we will discuss about uh, the linear versus nonlinear, the nonlinear form of the model and uh, what it implies in terms of uh, estimation method. The second uh, part will be devoted to sequential Monte Carlo methods. So uh, I will present uh, I will present the the, the, the probabilistic approach uh, and the tools that uh, will found the, the the sequential Monte Carlo method and the particle filtering. In the third section, I will present uh, simply the toy DAG model that uh, will be uh, used uh, to illustrate uh, the, the several filters uh, that are implemented in Dynar. So it's a very simple, uh, it's a very simple model that you can find in the literature uh, introducing particle filtering on the nonlinear DAG model. Uh, from the beginning. In the fourth part, uh, I will take, uh, I, I will spend the mo mo most of the time in the, in the fourth part to present uh, the different 
filters that are available in Dynar in order to, to estimate the nonlinear DG models. So this is filter, uh, in general, particle filter, but it can also uh, be uh, nonlinear filters uh, without particles. So we, we will have a, a discussion about that uh, because uh, particles generate uh, issues. In the uh, fifth uh, section, we'll talk about deep parameter estimation. So uh, we present uh, what is done in Dynar and uh, when can be, what, can be, what can be done uh, in this context. And the last one will conclude. So let's, uh, let's begin with Bayesian filtering methods in the next in the next files. 